My name is Lieutenant Colonel Frank Barrow. I'm the Director of Army Instruction for the Mobile County Public School System. For this week, I am the Camp Commander for the JRTC STEM Leadership Academy. To be competitive in the world today, to meet the challenges of a global economy, we had better step up our game. This type of program will do exactly that. Junior ROTC is, is probably the first class citizenship program in America today. But that being said, I thought there was an opportunity for us to do more than that. Well, the traditional curriculum was centered around drill and ceremonies, uh, color guard opportunities, air rifle marksmanship. But it was absolutely critical as we moved into the 21st century that we look to modernize what we do. In this type of program, you're going to help the child recognize the potential that they have. You're going to work on their strengths and help them develop their weaknesses and then show them a pathway that they can meet with success. It exposes them to what's out there and then it's up to them to act on it. There are three main components to this JRTC STEM Leadership Academy. The first is our STEM curriculum, which allows us to, to show and demonstrate to our students that they are much more capable in the STEM arena than they thought. Collectively, as a team, they have to go through at least three different very challenging projects. Second part of this is our JRTC activities, where we focus on teamwork, leadership, followership, decision-making, and overcoming fears. We do a drown-proofing exercise, but they learn how to survive in an emergency situation on the water. The second big activity for that is rappelling, where they have to conquer their fears of going over a 45-foot tower. And then finally, we introduce them to many of our business and industry partners that relate to our theme for this particular year's aviation and how those careers and opportunities are waiting for them if they make smart choices in high school, apply themselves academically, and take advantage of the opportunities when they present themselves. I want you to think about this. In small little Mobile, Alabama, an idea developed and it blossomed. Now we're being replicated at 10 different sites in seven different states across America. If we can have every JRTC program in the country do this, I believe that our value added as an educational component at these high schools will go up tremendously. The JRTC STEM Leadership Academy is not only an investment in tomorrow, but it will help guarantee the success of those young people that attend this academy. <laughs>